Welcome back. Today we have box number two from the $1,505 Amazon Custom Return Liquidation Palette. You've already seen the first box to this huge three box palette that was Amazon Custom Return Liquidation stuff. So this is hodgepodge, which means it can contain anything. Toys, electronics, pets, apparel, tools, houseware, home goods, kitchenware, bedding yeah all kinds of stuff first box was pretty eclectic with a lot of apparel uh pet supplies and this little little bit of, of electronics not much just a dabble and uh it was a decent box it wasn't like super exciting but there was a lot of really good brand new stuff in it which is nice to get brand new stuff in liquidation pallets that's a positive so uh my price i paid for this entire pallet was 323 dollars shipped so I had to pay shipping because I don't have any local liquidator that lets you go there in person now to pick up pallets because of the pandemic that's going on right now. So they're they're limiting in-person contact from the liquidator and customer. So even if you live in the same city, you have to pay shipping. At least shipping wasn't bad on this pallet since I live literally 30 miles away. It was like 62 bucks or 68 bucks to ship this pallet. So it was pretty cheap. So... Uh, yeah, the three twenty three that I paid that included the the purchase price, the ten percent buyer's premium, and the shipping costs. So it wasn't too bad. I had to pay in total like twenty percent of MSRP. I like keeping it around ten, but this is twenty twenty and liquidations now honestly sell on average between twenty and like forty to fifty percent now. Liquidations are much more expensive in twenty twenty. The days of ten percent or less. I think that's pretty much done. There's no pals anymore at 10% or less. They just don't exist anymore. So the profit margins are slimmer now. Be very wise on what you purchase because you've got to turn a profit. So, okay, I'm going to give you a sneak peek of what is in this box because some people like seeing a little sneak peek ahead of time. And some people don't. They want to be totally surprised because this is pretty much, this is a mystery box of Amazon customer returns. So if you don't want to see a sneak peek, just the top layer, fast forward about 30 seconds right now. If you stayed with me, here we go. Sneak peek, top of the box. Just open it up and right on top, I see looks like some kind of Adidas pants over there. This looks kind of interesting. We got some boxes of stuff, maybe electronics. We have a posture protector. That's kind of hard. We got a mystery box. So this could be kind of interesting. So let's go ahead. Let's dive into this box. Let's see what is in this. Okay, here we go. Amazon custom returns. First thing on top, I'm going to grab this on top. We have a pair of, looks like Adidas. Oh, brand new tags too. Sweet. Love that new tag stuff. It makes it so much easier to sell whenever it's new tags. Pair of Adidas pants. These are nice. It's a uh, size small retail for 40 bucks. Pretty cool. So like that, that's probably easy 20 bucks right there. Most all clothes are sold on our Poshmark store. There's a direct link down below in the, the, the description box to this video of our eBay store and the Poshmark store. Poshmark is mostly clothes. The eBay is all the hard goods and you know, normal stuff. Keep digging. We have a mystery envelope really we have one replacement watch okay it's on the floor so we'll we'll get that later <laughs> next let's see we have a mystery box a beauty set what Ro Rosalind boutique beauty set can I easily, it's not factory, no, it is factory sealed. It is factory sealed. So I don't want to open it up. It's factory. But this is a gemstone for wellness and beauty jade roller gua shawl set. That might be kind of expensive. I don't know much about that, but it's brand new. It's, here's the factory seals are still intact. Has not been opened up yet. I'll have to research this thing later and kind of find out price on this thing. Natural Jade Roller and Gua Shawl Set. Could have some value to it. Who knows? Then we have 
two pieces of plastic. Hodge Podge. What is this? I don't know. <laughs> Next. Let's see. Oh, we have two keychains. <laughs> a blue and a pink keychain. Next. Let's see what we have here. Oh, there we go. What is this? Oh, is this a back support? Yeah, it is. Oh, it's a molar back support. I used to get these quite a bit in liquidations. They sell pretty, pretty quickly too. This one doesn't look like it's been used because usually if it's been used, like shirt fuzz and stuff sticks to the uh, to the Velcro, so it doesn't actually it doesn't look used. And the molar sets, the back, uh, how much do I, do I sell it for you? I think like maybe like 15, 20 bucks in that range. They they do sell though. Then we have a pair of glasses right here. Wonder what brand it is. Brand is, I have no clue, but these things are incredibly cheap. Um, no, no, <laughs> these are incredibly cheap. These are junk, <laughs> those are junk. Let's put those aside. Let's see, what else we got? What else we got? We got a mystery box right here. It says it's made in China. So whatever it is, was made in China. Let's see what kind of goodies the brown mystery box possesses. It has Amazon warehouse tape on it. What is this? Like we have a bit of wood. These are glass tubes inside of these foam rollers. I have no clue what this is. I have, well it's sharp, whatever that is right there. It's like a screw or something. I have no clue what this is. Sometimes with hodgepodge, you run into stuff like that. No clue, <laughs> I have no clue what that is. Let's see, keep cruising. We have a genuine via vinyl branded. It's like a screen protector. Probably for like an iPad or something. Okay, this looks kind of cool. It has like a laughing face on it. Oh, this is this a gator necker? No. Okay. I think what this is actually, this is uh, mask patterns that people would cut the patterns out and create masks for. That's what it actually looks like. Then you would attach like strings or whatever to the ends of it. That's what that looks like where you create your own masks. Probably in here, you're probably going to have, yep, there's the, like the loops for it. So it's a create your own mask different don't know if there's much of a market for like a creature on mass thing because you can you can buy like cloth masks now pretty cheaply i mean you can get some cloth masks for like five or a target you can get a three pack for like four or five dollars it's really cheap like they don't cost very much so i mean the time it takes to make one i would just go buy one from like target for just a couple bucks Personal preference, you know, some people would like to make their own, I'm, I'm guessing. I don't know. What are you? We have a very long bag that holds something. Oh, I bet it's a, for an umbrella. It's an umbrella. That's what it's for. So for your, like, like your outdoors, uh, like, your, like your table and chair set, this is an umbrella uh, cover. Yep, that is what that is. Okay, back to a mystery box. We have something called an eye guard. A nice pouch. 
Looks like we got some aviators. Well, if they'll come out of there. Are you going to come out? There you go. So, oh, it's aviators with the uh, bifocals on them. Whoa. Yeah, the bifocals. Don't look through that. The bottom part here <laughs> has bifocals. So it's just sunglasses with some bifocals. Actually, if you block out the bifocal part, this actually looks really good. Like, uh, you know, it's like sun blockage part. Has that orange tint to it. But, uh, I don't know these have much value to them. They're not like a name brand or anything. Just called the brand is iGuard. I don't know if it has, it has any value to it. You'll be able to find this in our eBay store, I guess. Let's see, we have display flush mounting template flush mount kit. <laughs> okay, keep cruising. Let's see, here we got some purple clothes. We got some interesting stuff in here still. Very eclectic box again. Oh, Under Armour, sweet. Purple in color. It's size youth large. That's pretty nice. Under Armour. Oh, that's kind of cool. The sleeves, they go up and down Under Armour on the sleeves. That's pretty cool actually. This will be an easy sell. Poshmark, that'll be gone in no time. That'll sell pretty fast. Okay, we have a posture corrector. I know I should wear one of these because I'm always I'm always kind of like hump like hunched over, kind of like this. Like most people, you know, a lot of us we sit pretty poorly at our desks. But here's a posture protector. I'm sure these things you put it on, it forces you back all the time. It would it would help her posture. It'd help out your upper back pain, shoulder pain. All that pain. Oh, we got some swimming, go swimming goggles. Oh, we yeah, this time of year, post summertime. If you're not careful, you, you can get an entire liquidation pile of nothing but return sw uh, swimming accessories from the summertime. It's happened to me. A whole pile of everything used, used swimming stuff. So this says, uh, thank you. Looks like we have a whole thing of different different colors gloves. We got green and green and purple and orange gloves to wear. Pretty cool. Little note on top says, no inner seal. So somebody, somebody opened it, used it, returned it. So yeah. Let's see. Oh, we have like some jersey material right here. Eh, this might be underwear. We'll just keep that in the package for, for now. I don't like messing with used underwear. Oh, here we have some bands. These are um, like whenever you have surgery, you need to strengthen up your muscles or your bone, you know, like uh, arm surgery. Use these bands that you get from your uh, physical therapist. That's those like exercise bands. We have a filter, just an open box filter junk and here's something nice here we go we got plug-in smart dimmer from ge finally got a cool item right here Let's see what it looks like see if it's new or used if i can get it open there we go took me a minute to get it open well, that's nice it's all wrapped up still instructions let's see how much this thing sells for this actually might be one of the better items from this box Okay, I found on Amazon. If I had to look look for quite a while, looks like it sells Amazon new for twenty nine ninety nine, thirty bucks new, open box item. Still a good twenty bucks right there. Still a good twenty bucks. Let's see here, we have a we have a really cheap hat. I mean, it's cheap. Keep cruising. Oh, this looks like one of those. Oh, this that's what this thing is. Looks like one of those carrier things where you can put like 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 you fold it out. You can put groceries in it. You can have it has like dividers. You can, you can like stack your magazines in it. You know, one of those one of those things. Not super exciting. Then we have oh we have replacement uh, face outlets. That's fun. Oh wait a minute, and there's a Honeywell part in it too. There's also a Honeywell timer or piece to it. So, a little bit of value there. 
we have some OxyClean. <laughs> That's random. We have, oh, we, it's still factory seal. Looks like we have an iPhone cord in here. Power your life. Probably an off-brand iPhone cord. Then we have a small black bracket. Okay. What are you? Oh, it's a desktop mini humidifier. Brand is Elo Comus. That's different. Still factory seal too, but uh, it's kind of like an off-brand. Probably not very expensive, probably 10, 15 bucks, not very much. Okay, we have a mystery box. Somebody taped it shut, not factory sealed. Um, oh, I see. This has some kind of, oh, it's broken. It's like a glass thing. It's like a Goku or Vegeta or something. You put it on there and it lights up, but yeah, this thing, it's broken. <laughs> no good. So that's, that's kind of trash. Okay, next we have another box. Oh, we have a Silent Wings 8 computer fan. Jeremy to be careful with the packaging, don't tear up the packaging. That's still in there all factory packaged. Good to go. This might be a decent item. Probably not super expensive, but decent item. Let me look this thing up real quick. Sells new on Amazon for 26 bucks. So, sell new for 26, open box item. At least like 15 bucks, I bet. On eBay. Then we have a pet safe. Oh, it's a pet safe collar. Like a, oh, it's actually a shock collar. Yeah, I don't, I, don't, I don't like those things. It's not very nice to shock your pets. And then next we have, we have an Amazon basic pillow. Put that back in the box just for, for now. Then we have, oh, cool, we have a doctor's stethoscope. No way. You kind of like put it, then you put it under your ears and you can listen. <laughs> so we have a, like a play doctor's stethoscope set, even though it's like a real one now. That's pretty neat, a stethoscope. We have another mystery box. Oh, this really is. A whole box of replacement light switch plates. A whole box of them. There's probably 20 in there. At least, what, quarter a piece? Even like, oh, it, it, five bucks. Not much. Then we have brand new pro training collar. Helps prevent pulling and lunging. It's brand new. Factory seal packaging, too. Factory seal packaging. How much does it sell for, I wonder? On Amazon, it sells for 11 bucks on Amazon. So, probably put it on eBay for like five, six bucks plus shipping then. It won't sell very much. Okay, some fell. Don't know what it was. We have, oh, it's for a baby. It's a Hudson baby security blanket. How cute is that? Might have keep this for our grandson, maybe. And we've already bombed, I don't know how many things now. You know, he's he's already, he's like what? Two and a half months old, he's already kind of spoiled. <laughs> Sells new for 22 bucks, actually, on Amazon. So if we don't keep it, that's probably a good $15 plus shipping right there on eBay. Not bad. And we have, oh, we have two spray bottles in here. They're glass and they're bubble wrapped. So we got two replacement spray bottles. Sell these locally for like a buck a piece. I think we have like one thing left. Oh, we got two things. We have a bracket for, is it is called a ground bar kit. Sells on Amazon for 12 bucks. So eBay, like five, six dollars plus shipping again. It's like five bucks all I'm making. And last thing we have, LED headlight kit. That's kind of cool. Got some automotive in this one. This one's pretty eclectic. I mean, we had apparel. Oh, somebody put some like masking tape on this. It's not factory sealed. I would never cut open the factory seal if I didn't have to. Okay, okay. it's all in there where you can change out your headlights, make them like all fancy. I wonder if this thing has any value to it. I don't know really, I, I don't know automotive very well. I've never really sold much to do with automotive. So my knowledge in this kind of stuff, it's, it's pretty obsolete. Okay, I found it actually on Amazon. 
Sells new for $39.99, 40 bucks new. Open box item, at least $25 right there. So that's last item. Um, like I was saying, I don't really know prices very well on automotive. It's just, it's just not my reselling forte. Because everybody always has like your specialty. Like my specialty is more like electronics and toys. You know, ones I know really well, I know prices of. But uh, yeah, this was another very eclectic box from apparel, pet, small electronics, automotive, OxyClean. <laughs> um, yeah, very eclectic. So this is HodgePodge. It could be anything. So I still have one box to go. And there still hasn't really been any big ticket items yet. And this pallet had three of these huge boxes on it. And usually most pallets, you can have at least like one big ticket item, maybe two. So I'm guessing that third box might have a big ticket item in it. Because most pallets do with, with Amazon, whenever Amazon, whenever they create these pallets, like they purposely will put some big ticket stuff in there to kind of make the value worth it. So box number three should have something big in it, I'm guessing. It should. Unless there's something in these first two boxes that I just completely missed. And it's actually is expensive. I just didn't realize it. Which is possible. But you know what? I'll see you again next time. Thanks for watching. One more video left on this palette. So it'll be coming up here in just a matter of days. So stay tuned. And I'll see you next time.